What is up everybody? Welcome back to Periodic Surf Co. Now we have a really exciting announcement for you today and that is that we have ironed out a cheaper and easier shipping solution for our international customers that are interested in building our longer series of boards. Now with our international shipments we are limited to about the 2.1 meter mark which is roughly 7 foot before they start kind of getting hit with excess charges and adds up to three, four, five hundred dollars very quickly. So what we are doing for our international customers are actually cutting down our deck skins to be seven foot maximum and then adding some finger joints which are pre-cut so when you receive the deck skins, all you have to do one or two extra steps, which is joining your deck skins back together to make the final length. And the nice thing about this system is you don't need any long clamps to press it together because masking tape stretched across the joint does a really good job. Now I put a lot of effort into making sure that the actual profile that we came up with was really strong, but also sat and indexed together nicely. So when you get it, back at your workshop and you start gluing things together, you're not hit with any nasty surprises where you have to tune it up and just scratch your head looking for answers. Now, we did a whole series of tests where we were doing some destructive weight tests to see just how strong the finger joints were in comparison to just a straight piece of wood. Uh, and we were really surprised at just how close we got the strength. So now on uh, the straight pieces of wood with no finger joint, the maximum weight load that we saw was about 46 kilos which is about 100 pounds and that was a pretty catastrophic failure so it wasn't just a crack it was splintery all throughout the worst that we saw in a straight piece of wood was 35 kilos and uh, that was similar result again so just a, a good snapping with lots of splinters with the finger joints on the other hand which were just glued together using our recommended polyurethane glue the minimum strength that we saw was 36 kilos. So basically the same as the minimum we saw on a normal piece of wood with no joint. But the maximum we saw was 40 kilos, which is about 88 pounds. But while it did snap at the joint, the timber behaved exactly like the solid piece right up to that failure. So really impressed with those results. And this is all tested before fiberglassing or any sort of sealing is even performed. So real world results are gonna be even better. All right, so cool, you have shorter deck skins, but you know, why would I want that if I could just get full length deck skins? Well, the reason we're doing this is because all of you guys are reporting back that it's incredibly hard to get Polonia locally. So we are needing to supply it if we wanna fulfill the demand. Now I will just stress that this only is applying to those boards which are above the 6.5 mark. Up until that stage, full length deck skins are still fine. So at the end of the day, we think this is a really good solution and it's gonna get more of you guys building killer surfboards and uh, out on something that you have built with your own hands. So head over to DIYSurfboardKits.com and check out our range of DIY surfboard kits. And we have heaps of awesome news coming in the new year. So stay tuned for more info on that. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.